Hello everyone, this is Andrew Gaythorpe, President of Yarra Old Grammarians. Just wanted to reach out to you uh, before Christmas to, to wish you and your families a very safe and, uh, and happy holiday season uh, coming up. It's certainly been uh, a year to remember, uh, for all the wrong reasons probably, uh, and, uh, and many things that, uh, you know, as old grammarians we would have done, uh, we weren't able to do this year. So uh, we are kicking off in earnest uh, next year, you'll be glad to know. If uh, your reunions, which of course none of those really happened uh, this year at all, um, so if it was your 10 year reunion this year for example, we will in fact make the 10 year reunion uh, next year as well as the actual 10 year reunion. So we'll effectively be doubling up on our reunions uh, next year. Uh, it's an important part of the, of the old calendar, uh, catching up with uh, classmates from, uh, from years uh, when you uh, left uh, Yarra Valley and uh, a very important one that we didn't want to lose. So uh, if it, we have actually decided to double up, which is, is great news, and uh, please uh, look out for uh, information on the website or uh, on Facebook or Instagram uh, for when your reunion is coming up. If you have any interest in uh, championing the reunion, helping to organise it, then uh, please contact Rosie Brown um, at the Yarra Development Office. I should also say that the golf day is going ahead next year, uh, at least as far as we know, uh, for early April. So uh, we tried, I think, three times uh, this year and failed, unfortunately, through lockdowns, which was unfortunate. It is one of the most popular events on our calendar. So great to see that up again uh, for this coming year. The other, uh, the other event that I'd like to, or not event, but uh, the other uh, development, I guess, in uh, Old Grammarians, is that uh, we completely reviewed our strategy this year and in conjunction uh, with the school have agreed on a, a slightly different focus uh, for Yarra Old Grammarians in, in the year coming up. And effectively what this is a greater involvement uh, with the current student body. So there's a lot of uh, experience, a lot of live journeys out there amongst Old Grammarians that the uh, current student body could benefit from. We already have some activities involved in our careers and professional development within current uh, student body, such as uh, speed careering and mentoring. So we'll be looking to introduce new activities. And one of those uh, is actually inspired by uh, Paul Joy, uh, who is inspired by Yarra Podcasts, where we will create uh, short uh, career bites. We we'll call them on various uh, professions. And uh, think about when uh, you're a student at Yarra and uh, had a particular interest in a career or uh, were thinking about various subject choices, how useful information could have been from someone that had been there before and uh, you could seek advice from. So we'll be getting that up and running next year as well. Uh, it's very important that we keep in contact with the school and with the current student body uh, to participate and, and contribute uh, towards their development. So that's a terrific development for the old grammarians to, to get a boost in that particular area. And uh, we're very grateful for uh, the school to actually encouraging uh, that particular strategy and, and taking part in it. So to finish off on what has been a very interesting year, uh, I do like to say again, I wish your families and yourselves a really uh, happy and safe holiday season and uh, certainly what can only be a more prosperous 2021. I'll see you in the new year. Hello everyone, this is a big shout out to our Yarra Old Grammarians. This is the end of an extraordinary, bizarre and very disruptive year. Yes, you've heard it all before that uh, this is unprecedented. This year's been unprecedented and that word's been used a lot over the past year, but for schools, it's been a bit of a crazy space. We've been at school, we've been away from school, at school, away from school, and it's just rolled through the year like that. The good news is that Yarra's still here and we're doing very well, and the online learning program we had for the students was outstanding. So we believe they didn't miss out on much. What we did miss out on, though, was the opportunity to have our Yarra Old Grammarians back here or at various functions throughout the year. So we certainly miss that. Uh, so it's our earnest hope that next year, 2021, will be a year of celebrations of being back in the social space and perhaps a number of our old grammarians coming back to the school. Now, if you haven't been here for a while, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. Uh, there's been lots and lots of change here in terms of uh, buildings and grounds and so forth. At the moment, we're uh, building our three-storey fine arts faculty up on Kalinda Road. It's a magnificent new building that house all of our art design technology classes. So 
there's plenty to see here at Yarra. So if you even get a chance informally to have a wander through the place at some stage, have a look around, re-engage with the old school, but also see some of the new developments we've had since your time here. Yes, we've certainly missed you this year and we look forward to catching up next year. On behalf of all of us here at Yarra, Merry Christmas. I hope you have a safe, happy and above all healthy new year. And we look forward to seeing our Yarra Ogramarians in 2021.